to the Liberty Wings traditional reservists, the core of our combat capability, you inspire me. You inspire me. I'm amazed by the way that you balance your lives, your professional lives, your families. I don't know how you do it, but I'm inspired by it and I'm so grateful for it. Together, we will aggressively pursue our readiness, our resilience requirements as outlined in the task board, and we will build upon our combat capability. And we will stand ready to defend our nation if called. So if you didn't know, we're on an operating flight line. And that's the sound of freedom that happens day in and day out, 24-7 uh, in our great nation with our different weapon systems. It's great to be back in Dover, Delaware. And when people ask me, hey, uh, in your 33 years of experience, what's been your most enjoyable base? Where have you enjoyed serving and living the most? And I always say Dover, Delaware. In 2022, Eric became the commander of the 931st Operations Group. What led Eric to this point in time to seek other opportunities and experience further success was a love for his country, a devotion to family, and an honor to contribute and continue to serve the Air Force. Eric, as you take command of the 512th Airlift Wing, I don't have to tell you that nowhere else will you have a greater ability to motivate and influence airmen's lives than as a wing commander. So my advice to you airmen, you warriors from the 512th Liberty Wing, is to work it. This is the best side hustle you will ever have. You should love what you do here. You are part of an amazing organization of volunteers that makes a real difference in the balance of power around the world. You are part of that. Embrace it. Be proud of it. And most importantly, make a difference in that, in that which you can affect. Move through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that... Zero one two, Colonel Eric J. Rivero assumes command of the 512th Airlift Wing, effective 4 May 2024.